Hi, I'm Jim Camposano, editor of Super Chevy Magazine, and we're here at the fifth annual Super Chevy Suspension and Handling Challenge presented by Neato Tire. I have with me here Craig Morrison, Vice President of Art Morrison Enterprises. This is their entry this year, this gorgeous 55 Chevy with your full chassis underneath. Craig, tell us about the chassis you guys make for the Tri-5s. Well, this chassis here is the first of our GT Sport bolt-on chassis line, and it's got every body mount, bumper mount, core support, all the mounts that you need to go ahead and just take one of these classic 55 to 57 Chevy bodies and bolt it right down onto our chassis. And uh, that was the whole sort of premise of, of designing this chassis, was to, to have the classic looks of the, the body style, but bring the performance and handling up to modern day standards. What is in the front suspension? What kind of front suspension do you have in here? The, the front suspension is our own design of an upper, upper and lower tubular control arm setup, I mean, kind of similar to what everybody uses, um, but we really had a focus on the performance and, and also the ride quality. We use one of the new uh, Willwood Pro spindles. We use a power rack and pinion steering, and most of the chassis that we sell uh, also utilize the Willwood disc brakes. Well, the great thing about this car is that you can go ahead and drive it anywhere. And I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to hop in this and take off. Craig, All right, thanks have for a your fun time, time and thanks for the car. Yeah, not a problem. <laughs> See you later. Art Morrison, they brought a 55 Chevy to the fight, and uh, that car definitely didn't disappoint. What I liked about it, it was so predictable. It did not handle, nor act, nor respond like a big car that it is. And I tell you, it seemed to me like it would fit through places that would cause a Mazda Miata just to shudder. Uh, what I liked about it was the turn-in, the response. It was crisp, it was precise. You could put that car wherever you wanted and you could get it to slide and you could move it about, yet when you had to put, put the nose on the ground and plant the brakes and get that front end getting set to turn, the car was right there with you. 